this. Whoa! That was really gross. You wanted them look. Okay, hair is done. Can't really tell because it's all tucked into my scarf. Right now we're going to this place called By Chloe. Ryan found it and it's a vegan restaurant so we're super excited. The snow is ridiculous right now and it's so cold. We got a little ahead of ourselves and ate our treats before we could film them. Oops. I wasn't even thinking. No. This used to be a circle. It's so cold. Me too. Well, well, well. Hello. Look who we have here. Making an appearance. The worst. I know. The I. Worst I am. Uh, wait. Why did you tell me? Why was anybody telling me my hair looked like this? Marlon says fashion is all about being messy. You gotta be messy because it has to be, you know, loose. Yeah. It, it can't be too contained. Wisdom. Essence of cool. Obviously. You say I look disheveled all the time. That's why. Because cool, right? I'm cool. <laughs> What's Daniel doing besides not appearing? Say hi to your family. Hi, family. What do you guys got going on Friday? Friday? Looking sexy, girl. A real, real sexy with this. <laughs> yep. Just just hanging out. Classy. Alright, you ready to go? Let's roll. How long has it been there? Um, probably a month or so. <laughs> Let's go so we can get back home. It's snowing again. I can't even. Ugh. I was in the process of cleaning out my makeup drawer and then we have to run to the office, so. Snow! It's Saturday morning and we're headed to the office for a few hours. We have a meeting on Saturday this morning. Um, so we're gonna be there for a few hours and then we're gonna pop back home because it is snowing. Actually, are we gonna go to Ricky's still? Richards. Richards? We're going to Ricky's because I need some new tanning stuff. I didn't even get to properly show you guys my hair. So, here's my hair. We took the balayage um, all the way, not all the way, but really far up to the top just because it's less maintenance when it grows out. So um, it's a little blonder, but I love the grow out process when it starts growing out and looks a little bit more faded. But my stylist, Bianca, it was my first time going to her and she's amazing. I recommend her to anyone who's in the city. She's just awesome. Um, her Instagram is at hairthrone but I'll link all of her stuff below. Um, she's, I can't even tell you, she's amazing. So if you're ever in the city and you need your hair done, go to her, she's so good. Sunglasses inside, huh? Sometimes when your future's so bright, you just gotta wear shades. Wow. So I just got like this tea, but instead of a tea bag, they put a flower in it, and then the flower blooms when it's inside your cup. Show it to you, it's a cool thing. Okay, ready. What? Gum. I think it's like lavender, lemon, honey. I want more flowers. More flower? Where can I buy? More flap date. More flowers. More flap I have the weirdest hairline, so I'm not sure about this braid, but um, I'm just gonna roll with it. Hairline is not. All right, so. We left the office and now we're heading to Juice Generation because I want an acai bowl. Generation of juice? Yeah. Tea that I got was so good earlier, but uh, I kept getting flour, like in parts of flour in my mouth. I don't like that. All right. PB acai bowl. Muy delicious. So last night, 
we made homemade ramen. It's true. And it was pretty good. Um, I'll put the recipe below if you want to see. Or if you want to see, I can just do this. <laughs> Ta-da! I'm excited. It was really good last night. Left but yeah, it was, it was pretty easy. Poor Ryan can't use chopsticks to save his life. I, tr I try very hard, but my hand cramps up. <laughs> like, I'm what? also probably not doing it right. Yeah, you're definitely not doing it right. I, um, I tried to teach him, but it just does not work. We went to the ramen place in San Diego called Underbelly, and it was so sad trying to watch him. They don't have silverware there. And um, it was really sad, so I was trying to like feed him. <laughs> I I feel ashamed of myself, but Aww, I can't help it. Oh, it's okay. Look at him eating with his fork. That's so sad. He also made me put pinto beans in the ramen to get protein. I said black beans. Yeah. You put pinto beans. Yeah, I don't know. The recipe calls for tofu, but I just don't like it. I'm not I like opposed. tempeh. Tempeh? Tempeh? Yeah, that's good. We had that at um, Cafe Gratitude. And it was delicious. Mm. Huh? We need to do some better here. What? We... Brian and I are about to look for a dining table. Because we keep talking about it and it just keeps not happening. So We have been interviewing some potential candidates for interns for life by her so that's been really exciting i think we've narrowed it down to a couple there was one that i really really liked so um i'm really excited to call her and tell her or ask her hopefully she's still she's still available fun process yes yeah, growing your team like when you're first starting a business so growing your team is a really exciting Thing, but it makes me nervous too, you know. But it's gonna be good. And I never told you guys, I'm getting so many comments how Olivia's doing, and Olivia is doing great. She's just a little brown, but she's doing awesome. She's ready for her new home that we move into in a week. Ten days. Ten days from today, we're moving. I just wanted to show you guys what I got from Ricky. So I got these wax strips. Hair removal strips for the face honey formula. I'll let you know how they go. Ryan, hey girl. we have a question for you. Hit me with your question. What is your query? Did you toot? Yeah. Oh my god, I'm gonna puke. Where's your theory? Come here. I got these wax strips. Okay. These. Okay. And we all know that you have very luscious, thick eyebrows. Okay. So we were wondering if maybe you would let us put a wax strip on them. Okay. You're gonna do it? Yeah, bro. You're gonna, wait. You're gonna let you're gonna let us wax your eyebrows. Sure. So here's what we were thinking. So we were thinking just like right, like right here. Okay. That works for you. Works. Can't wait. I'll do mine too, so you don't feel alone. No, I won't be lonely. We'll be wax sisters. We will be wax sisters. Hi. Oh wow. Look what Ryan picked up at the grocery store. Well, we got that at Whole Foods a while back. Oh. We just hadn't eaten it yet. But so tonight's, tonight. tonight's dinner is making random stuff and throwing it in a bowl. So we've got sweet potato going on. It's going to be delightful. We've got Beyond Meat, which I don't know if I'm going to take part in that. Sorry. We've got some quinoa going. We've got some sprouted toast, some black beans, and some lettuce, and some avocado. I feel like... This is gonna be like a good like taco ball. Uh, duh. Oh, you already knew? Of course I did. That's why I got the fake taco meat. I think you're just excited because I'm gonna wax your eyebrows. False. I'm doing it. We'll see. 
And we already told everyone that we were going to do Well, who'd you tell? Did she tell you? I mean, I agree to a lot of stuff. What are you doing? I'm fixing the cam. I agree to a lot of stuff just to, so that we don't have a... You're going to make everyone sick, but... Apologies. I spilled the quinoa a while ago. Yeah, I agreed to vacuum that. He vacuumed. That was so nice. I do a lot around here. Where did our neighbor go? He was just sitting at his desk. Creep you later, bro. You know what I'm afraid of? Hmm. I'm afraid that if I wax my, my eyebrows, it's going to rip my spray tan, my tan off. That's a possibility. <gasps> well, I don't want that. These are the risks. This is what we whip together. Dun, dun, dun. Excuse me. <laughs> We've got a bowl of lettuce, black beans. I'm going to go ahead and give the fake meat a chance. Avocado, sweet potato, quinoa. Tell people about it. I was just gonna have a sweet potato for dinner and then we just started pulling things out of the refrigerator. Whenever in doubt, throw stuff in a bowl. Yeah. That's pretty much our dinner motto. Okay. Pretty much rule number one. And it's gotten me to where I am today. Update on the fake meat. It was actually pretty good. I would eat it again. I'm not really, like, before I was on a plant-based diet, I wasn't really a big meat eater anyway, so I wasn't, like, so excited about it, but it was good. Definitely added some flavor. Why do you have shoes on? What? People walk on their, like, shoes out here. Oh, good. Here's what the wax strips look like. So they come apart, so you've got two. Spot. Your eyebrows are gonna look so. How long do you leave it on? You just don't. You don't leave it on. Oh, so you're gonna rip it now? Yep. Holy f really? Right. right. You can't say that word on the Sorry. vlog. You can bleep it. So I get to squeeze you. It no. Would, the pain that I feel. No. Oh, don't squeeze my legs. I can't help it. If you it's... squeeze, if you squeeze my legs, I might mess up. I'm gonna count to three. Okay. Okay. One. Whoa! Whoa! Not even that much and it hurts so bad. Mmm. You had so much hair. Oh, that's not that much hair. That is too so much hair. No, I don't even know if it'll not. focus. Next side. Ready? <clears throat> don't go like that. I'm gonna count <clears throat> to... Yeah, you're not gonna count at all. You just rip. Okay, fine. Okay. <clears throat> Whoa. Yeah, I'm super stoked for this. It's like a whole new you. Now we need to do right here. No, we're not doing anymore. Why not? Because we're finished for the night. But you have more hair like Yeah, right here. like you, you do it in like stages and I'm good. I'm glad that 2017 was stage one and <laughs> 2018 we can work on stage two. There's, there's like cooling lotion. Oh, now you bring out the cooling lotion after, like, the burning sensation's gone. Sorry. So now we'll see if you have a weird reaction before I try it on myself. Sure. I know your game. We should hug it out. It won't be bad. It looks so good. Totally not bad. Good morning. We are headed to B&H because we're having a stabilization issue and we don't know don't the know. source of it. Brightness? So bright. So this morning I woke up and filmed a little bit for the how to style, nope, what I wore that goes live today. So I just wrapped that up and then we're about to head out and go to B&H. So yeah, that's what we're doing, B&H bound. I think we're gonna walk. We don't mind it. Yeah, it's not terrible outside. It's cold but the sun's out so that helps. Yeah. We watched a scary movie last night and it was really disturbing and I woke up yeah, she twice that. with nightmares. I love scary movies, but this movie was just gross. What was it called again? The Green Inferno. The Green Inferno. Yes. No me gusta the Green Inferno. Very gory. I don't even mind gory, but this was just gross. How do your eyebrows look today? Let's have to head out to B&H, but before we go, I just wanted to say really quickly that 
We are getting so many questions in our Life by Hair community, a lot of business related questions. I didn't realize this, but we have- And emails. And emails, yeah. yeah. We have so many bloggers, YouTubers, entrepreneurs in our Life by Hair community, which is amazing. So we are gonna jump on a live stream, Facebook, for the uh, Life by Heart community. Sometime at the end of this week, we will announce the date to you guys in the community very soon. And if you're not signed up for the Life by Heart community, definitely go because we're gonna start doing these live stream Q and A's yeah, often. Yeah, provide a lot more value. Yeah, to, because- To the girls who are interested in this stuff because we didn't really know how many girls were interested in this. And now that we do, we can give a lot more feedback on how you can build your blog, build your vlog, all that kind of stuff. Yeah, your YouTube channel, just your business. So I really think that we can bring a lot of value to you guys just because we've we've gone through the the first steps of things. And I think, you know, having someone guiding you really makes it a lot easier. So we are gonna hop on that sometime at the end of this week. So um, all of you guys who are in the Life by Hair community, stay tuned. We will send out an email and I'll announce in the group when and what time, like what day and what time it's gonna be. And, um, and if you're not in the group, Go sign up. <laughs> Go sign yes. up because, yeah, it's not just, our community is not just fashion. I mean, we, there are so many business related things that we have going on over there and it's more so even now that we're going to be doing these Q&As. So um, if you just want to yeah. be a part of like a really powerful community of women uplifting each other, like this is the totally. place that you want to be. So come join us. Okay, you got your sunglasses on. It is really bright in here. We were about to okay. leave and I was like, wait, we need to tell them about the thing. Okay, let's go. All right, here we go. Happiest place on earth. It's like Disneyland. B and H. Vlog. Hello. Hi, Hi. thank Hi. you. Oh, it's warm, I love it. Yes. <laughs> nice. All right, so what are we looking for? First, the bathroom. Ryan. I know where it's at, actually. I know you know where it's at. Recording or not? Wait. Wait. That's, that's the right noise. Pull over. Huh. Okay. Recording? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we just got done at B and H. We really just needed to go because Ryan had some questions. It's a good thing about B and H is they have super, super knowledgeable people there that use the same equipment that they sell. So instead of like having to buy new stuff. The guy just told me what I was doing wrong and how to fix the issues. Yeah. And there we go, all for free. And I bought a camera strap. And she did buy a camera strap. So B and H. It's so cute. Is the shiz. We're going to this place called. How many times have you told me? And I still can't remember. Pure Kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to Pure Kitchen to grab some lunch, and I'll show you my camera strap when we sit down. Not Are you getting dripped on? Yeah, we're walking right through it. Can I wait for the food to get here? It's so good. Oh my gosh, we got caught in a wind tunnel on the way home and I almost blew away. That was really bad. Ryan's doing surgery. Surgery, get this fool to stay straight. You're very serious right now. Oh, this is very serious. In the meantime, I'll show you my camera strap. So I guess the brand, oh wait, that's not the brand. So I got this from B&H. This is a trap, I'm trying to get this strap out right now. I think I'm doing it wrong, wait. Oh man, I don't know what I'm doing, hold on. I'm gonna use a knife, don't be mad. Too late. Here's my strap. Look how cute it is. It's like rose embroidery. I love it. Okay, I have it on. You can't really see it because I'm holding the camera. Oh man, I didn't really think this through very well. Anyways, this is what it looks like. <laughs> I don't even own a camera strap, so this will be nice to have. Okay, I have to go edit and edit some more. Cause I gotta get a vlog out tomorrow and I've gotta finish the video for today. So I will see you guys later. Bye. Oh, we just ate at this like 
the place we were going to go to was closed. So we ate at this place called... No idea what the name was. I don't know. We, it wasn't good. So we, I liked it. I didn't like it. like it. And I'm not picky. You're one of the most picky eaters I've ever known. I like everything except for blue cheese. And, and, ex and except for things that have like weird texture, except for things that have a little extra flavor to them, except for things that have some spice on them. I'm a texture person. I don't like weird textured things. I still love you. I'm gonna go work. Me too. Don't follow me. Mm -hmm. Cold at the touch, dead in the eyes. No signs of life, no more. I Put your love under the knife